Okay, so I am diagnosed at age 34 and my youngest of three was just 12 months old. We, we did everything we needed to do from a cancer point of view. I had the mastectomy, I had six rounds of chemotherapy and it was 18 months after I'd finished all my treatment that I was sat with my breast care nurse because we were talking about further surgery to remove my um, breast that was still there. She spotted straight away that I was somebody that had kind of autopiloted, and they were kind of her words. And I needed to go and really probably talk about what had happened and how I actually really felt, because I think all I'd done is um, managed the situation in the moment from a, from a medical point of view, and I don't think I'd taken stock from a mental point of view. And I actually felt quite sad that that somebody else thought I needed some help. I thought I'd failed and I couldn't have been further from the truth. It, it was the best thing I ever did. But I think I just was scared, if I'm totally honest. I was scared of admitting, probably out loud, to many people, I've got cancer, I'm in the middle of cancer. It was almost like if I took help about it, it made it more serious and more real. I just didn't want to talk about it and really I should have, I should have come sooner. In, in actually recognising that it's okay to talk, you're not giving in, you're not giving up, you haven't, you know, you haven't missed everything, you've just allowed yourself to stop still, exhale and start taking on board what's just happened and making sense of it and I think until I did that I probably would have just carried on this kind of autopilot and I don't know at what point I was going to crash and burn and that's that's something that I will you know be forever grateful to because actually it's seen me back to the new normal I am now.